Hello everybody and welcome to the last part uh, to making chair in uh, SOLIDWORKS uh, we will arrive to here in the last episode now let's make uh, all the component uh, uh, in this section let's start part 5 use the front plan and with uh, with 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 21 diameter and extrude with uh, 23 click ok and Uh, you can use the offset with 0 0.5 reverse and the uh, feature extrude cut with 18 use the fillet with 3 and now click here rectangle use this rectangle it's I think okay and just use it you can uh, you can use two for example and 0 0.5 if you want and use the fillet with 0 0.4 and click OK and now select all this go to circular sketch pattern uh, OK 17 and go to extrude extrude with 20 reverse click OK and now select this face and put a circle with 21.7 use feature extrude feature with one millimeter but here use thin feature the thin feature you can just use 0 0.5 and the reverse direction click OK and now we have the this part the part 5 you can just save it and use if you want uh, plastic low glossy ok and come to assembly sorry for that and uh, click in this button put two of them can just click in the mate and this circle reverse ok the same thing here click here and in this sketch in this edges I click ok and now use use this one mirror component uh, choose the plan the plan you can uh, use the the right plan of the part uh, 4 and component to mirror just use this and this click here it's the same thing click OK now and we have four of them and now 
let's go and put the part here uh, it's the part uh, 6 start a new file from the front use the circle with diameter of 15 extruded with 10 millimeter and use the top plane to sketch a circle with diameter 20 and the distance from here we have 15 and just add a relation with this one vertical go to feature extrude cut feature use mid plan click ok and use a fillet with with what with two millimeter in this face and use a shell with one not one meter but one millimeter okay and use a fillet with 0 0.5 in this face click ok and it's just we have to add a hole here with four millimeter Um, and go to feature, extrude feature, click OK, and you put uh, OK material and save your part part six, and now go to your assembly. You can just insert component. OK and you have got to select these edges with mate with this one reverse and uh, to fix it with this we have to look for the top plane of this uh, the top plane yes the top plane no, it's not the top plan, but uh, I think the right one. The top plan of this uh, part. This part is the part one. Go to the part one. And choose the top. See that? And go to the part six. choose the the right plan okay now it's adjusted with uh, with this okay the same thing here you can just click and drag use the control key in your keyboard and we have the second part use the mate for this one uh, we can we can use this because the surface it's not uh, plan use the hole and this hole for example and uh, and and what Okay, and uh, oh, yes, you have to add this one. To this one and you have to reverse because we have to add the relation with this 
and this one tangency and reverse it and we have the the, the relation and the same thing but you have to add the relation with this one and this one with the top line of this part the name of this part it's the second part part two go to top plane and the right plane of the of the part six where is the part six it's not this it's this one okay validate now and uh, we have two parts to add okay mm start from the front sketch that's the part seven we have eight here it's should be with two and we have four millimeter in this circle extruded with uh, 26.5 use the chamfer here with one millimeter and use the fillet with one and uh, extrude here with one millimeter and 0 0.5 and just add material save your part and put it in your assembly here to reverse it and choose this plan with this plan okay we have a nice assembly uh, the last part is the same thing but it's not uh, the same uh, uh, it's not the same uh, diameter We have three here. Okay. Extruded with forty three point five and uh, chamfer with one. It's time to prior. We will finish this. Fill it with the three. Okay. And select this one. Uh, use offset with one millimeter with 0 0.5. Okay. Use material, save your file, go to your assembly, import it, okay, reverse uh, direction, select this and this one click OK now then we have finished the component now you can just you 
you can just uh, edit the mirror uh, function and add all of uh, this and this one this and this component let's see okay okay perfect okay now validate from here and we have all the components in our chair but I forgot something here we have to fix the seat with the sheet metal to make this one it's go to edit part select this face go to hold wizard and go to position click in a normal tool you can just select all the hole in the sheet metal okay and that's the last one click in escape and uh, delete this one now go to type choose this with ISO here make M3 and validate now validate from here and go to your library toolbox add in now and we have to add uh, some uh, scroll with the uh, ISO go to bolt and screw cross screw choose the last one okay wait a uh, little bit and uh, here put Eight to see if we okay it's okay and validate from here and put the same thing in other in others hall we have one here and we have one where is it and we have one here okay and uh, click in the cross and we have finished our uh, chair the image uh, you look in the tutorial is uh, uh, with uh, rendered with key shot if you have any question for uh, how to render this in Keyshot, I will make a tutorial for you. And if you like uh, all uh, this work, uh, you can just uh, leave me a comment and uh, subscribe to my channel. Thank you for all uh, all the subscribers and uh, share my uh, videos to. Uh, to have more fun thank you and uh, see you next tutorial and uh, see you later